What's going on you guys? Today we're going to be learning the song By Dirt by Jordan Davis. I hope this video lesson is very helpful for you and you find it enjoyable. So let's get into it. You are watching Logan's Lessons. We need four chords to learn this song. The first chord is an E major chord. You will play E major by putting your middle finger on the second fret of your A string, your third finger on the second fret of your D string, and your first finger on the first fret of your G. That is an E major chord. The second chord we have is a B major chord. This is the hardest chord in the song. I will show you the most accurate way to play this chord, but if you hold tight for just a second, I will also show you a bit easier way to play it as well. The technically correct way of playing a B major chord goes like this. You're gonna put your first finger on the second fret of your A string and then you bar your third finger across the D, G, and B strings. That is a B major chord. Now, if you want a little bit of an easier way of playing this, you can simply put your first finger on the second fret of your A string and your third finger on just the fourth fret of your D string. It's not as full and it doesn't sound exactly like the recording like the regular B major will but it'll sound okay and it's quite a bit easier. So that's how I would do that. The third chord we have is an A major chord. The A major chord will be accomplished by putting your first finger on the second fret of your D string, your middle finger on the second fret of your G string, and your third finger on the second fret of your B. All of those chords I have just listed show up in every section of the song, but the very last one, a C sharp minor, only shows up in the chorus and in the bridge of the song. You'll play the C sharp minor by putting your first finger on the fourth fret of your A string. Your third finger will be on the sixth fret of your D. Your pinky will be on the sixth fret of your G string, right below your third finger. And your middle finger will be on the fifth fret of your B string. So. That's what a C sharp minor chord should sound like. Those are the four chords. So let's talk strumming pattern for a second. The strumming pattern stays completely consistent throughout the entire song. We will use E major for example. The strumming pattern will be a down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Again with E major chord, do it with me. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Okay, and that's exactly how you play the intro actually. It just stays on the E major chord. It goes down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down. So you do the down, down, up, up, down, up. You do that four times for the intro. And that gets us into the verse. For the verses, we are going from E major to B major to A. You do A again, back to E major. gets you into the chorus, okay? That is how you play the verses. So the chorus only adds one chord. In place of the A playing twice, you instead play the C sharp minor and then A. So we have. And that loops for a while. That gets us into the interlude, if you will, which plays like this. So just E to B, and then it starts over at the beginning of the verse chord progression. The verse chord progression for the second verse only plays one time through, so it feels kind of short, but that's just the way it is. Then you're back into the chorus, and that drops us into a bridge slash solo section, if you will. The um, bridge slash solo section will go from C sharp minor to B to A to E. And then he starts singing and you go to a B major chord again. Like so. So the whole solo slash bridge section will sound like this. And 
that drops us into a down chorus, which you just strum each chord out once. And then a normal chorus, and that's the end of the and song. And that, my friends, is how you play By Dirt by Jordan Davis. If you have a song request, please comment it. If you wish to be notified of future videos, hit the bell. I sincerely hope that you are well. Please hit that like button blue. I'd really appreciate it. If you subscribe too, I hope this video has been a blessing. You've been watching Logan's Lessons.